at what point during the process when you were kind of digging into the characters that you could potentially play in this particular film did you realize this is something I want to tackle? Pretty much immediately. It's not often you get a script as brilliant as Chloe's and, and I read it and had that feeling that I think is sometimes quite rare that it's like I have to play this role. I, I know this person and I've been through a lot of her experiences. I, I know women that have been through a lot of her experiences and you know to bring it to life in this kind of heightened way um, just seemed really exciting to me. When Chloe and I spoke you know she just the, the sense of how personal this story was and how born uh, her feelings and experience it was that's my favorite kind of thing to do as an actor and she just did a wonderful job. What's the hardest thing that Chloe made you do on set? That was anything she made us do. Um, but uh, I had a whip. <laughs> I had a whip and yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but Chloe has an amazing way of just making you feel very safe, and I, I just felt that I could go to places that even I wasn't expecting to go, which is kind of brilliant as an actor. You know, when you have something in your head and then you're on set and. You know, Chloe would just, she would always want to take it just that step, step yeah. further, um, which was a very thrilling experience. The movie, it, it's odd in a way to say this, but it was so fun. I mean, it was, it's, it's challenging, but it was, it was uh, that's what you, you know, that's part of what's really fun as an actor is to get emotionally rich, intense, dynamic material. What was your favorite thing to do to de-stress from a day of really intense filming? A bath. But also because it was really cold where we were filming, yeah. so I would say a bath, was, was that it? But also I think you're going and going and going all day and your adrenaline's going, and so by the time you get home, you're just, you're crashed. It's just like you don't, you don't have time to de-stress, you're just, you're going, you're up, and then you're down. Like, that's what it is. It was a challenge because um, every scene is so heightened, so it just felt like the adrenaline was running non-stop. <laughs> Usually a hot shower would do it. Yeah walk around, try to read a book or whatever. I had COVID right when I got there mm. for a week. And so during that whole time, I just watched um, like every uh, 80s, 90s romantic comedy kind of thing. What was your favorite? Notting Hill, when which Harry is really similar to this movie in a lot of ways, just tonally. Interesting. When Harry met Sally. I love that too, but <laughs> Notting Hill has a special place for me. Thank you. Yeah. My pleasure.